Hi, my name is Anastasia from La Pintoresca Branch Library. I'm going to be showing you how to make your own Amate folk art. But first, let's learn a little bit more about Amate paper. Nearly 2,000 years ago in ancient Mexico, Amate paper was used by the Aztecs to keep records and create codices. Codices were used to tell stories, making them some of the earliest form of books. Amate paper is traditionally made by harvesting the soft inner bark of a fig tree and then soaking that bark in water until it has softened. Then, the bark fibers are placed on a board and beaten with stones until it is flat. Then it is hung to dry. The process of creating amate paper has been passed down for many centuries. In modern-day Mexico, amate paper is used in a type of folk art. Mexican amate paintings commonly feature birds, flowers, and scenes of everyday life depicted in an intricate style using brightly colored paints. Today we will be using paper bags as our amate paper. If you weren't able to pick up a kit, you can do this project at home with your own paper bag and wax crayons. Use a template or draw your own designs onto the paper bag. Try taking inspiration from other amate paintings. You can draw flowers and flourishes to make your design more complex. Keep the design simple, but add lots of repeating shapes and patterns. Once you have your design, you can begin coloring it in with your oil pastels. If you have never used oil pastels before, think of them as a solid paint that you can spread around. You can blend your pastels together to create new colors, or layer them on top of each other. You can use your fingertip or a q-tip to blend them or smear them to cover even more space. Don't be afraid to experiment. Remember to use bright colors to make your design pop. Don't worry too much about staying inside the lines. You can always fix it later with a black colored pencil. When you are finished coloring, you can use a q-tip and white paint along the edges of your design to add decorative dots. After the paint has dried, crumple your paper bag into a ball. Then carefully unfold it and crumple it again. Repeat until you get a texture you like. This helps us to create a texture that resembles the roughness of a mate paper. Press your paper flat and your mate painting is finished. 